There have been some gross misperceptions about life insurance underwriting that sadly have persisted over the years. Just a few examples of these misperceptions include how information is shared with the Medical Information Bureau, or MIB, the value of reinsurance, and whether specific medical procedures may prevent one from obtaining life insurance. It's imperative to discern facts from fiction in the underwriting process in order to determine the best course of action for your valued client. Your Prompt Underwriting Team is here to help dispel these myths and misperceptions. If the beneficiary and owner of a life insurance policy are not satisfactory during the underwriting of the application, they will not be satisfactory after placement. For example, an underwriter may be on guard when receiving a life insurance application with a son-in-law as owner and beneficiary. Avoiding speculation and ensuring insurable interests, such as a real interest in the continued survival of the insured, is of paramount importance in new business underwriting. In the first two years after the placement of life insurance coverage, you can expect any proposed changes to the owner or beneficiary to be sent back to the underwriting department for review. Offering your client a good reason to buy life insurance is only half the battle. You must also be prepared to provide the life insurer with an owner and beneficiary structure that makes sense. We recommend that you call your Crump underwriter in situations that may be uncommon before application submission to find a solution that works for everyone. For more information on insurable interest, click the link in the video description.